Hello, my name is Homan Retractor. We would like to thank Medline for providing us with this Koenig and First instrument used in this video. On today's instrument, this one is a short tip and an eight millimeter blade, six and a quarter inches long. And so you'll be measuring the length of the instrument from the uh, proximal end to the distal tip. And then as you're looking at the type of Hohmann retractor that's in front of you, it's important to keep in mind that there are tons of variations of Hohmann retractors. You've got long blades, you've got short blades, you have angles, you have blunt tips, you have other tips that are not necessarily blunt, but, but not sharp either. So um, it's very important to know what is in front of you as you're processing these homens in particular. You'll often see these obviously in your orthopedic trays, and this instrument is used for exposing bone during procedure. So you got a broad flat blade with a curved profile that makes insertion and exposure easier for the surgeon. As you're inspecting and identifying your Homan retractors, it's important to keep in mind that tip does need to be in good operational position or condition. Okay, and they do get beat up sometimes. They'll get uh, chipped, they'll have divots and uh, slices out of them in that uh, even though the orthopedic world is hard on its instruments you do want to be aware that all of the instruments need to be in working condition and so if you see a home and come back that's clearly bent out of its original profile or there's a chip there's a divot in there that's that's making it difficult to clean uh, that device needs to be taken out of service and either repaired or replaced by the instrument provider. Uh, typically when you're assembling home and retractors you'll see these especially on these um, smaller versions you'll see these go into paper sterilization bags often or uh, gathered together in the bottom of a tray. Now uh, keep in mind anytime that you can do things to protect these distal tips so these instruments you're going to want to try to do it so there are some folks out there that will put a tip protector for instance on the tip of their home and retractors um, especially for these smaller home ends that are e easier to damage in your full size ones all right again the one that we're looking at today is a short tipped eight millimeter blade six and a quarter inches long all right that's all for this episode of hello my name is and that is the homan retractor thank you for tuning in again and until next time keep fighting dirty <laughs>